Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Gina DeVecchio. Happy Monday, everyone. I don't know if you're as happy as I am to see some rain around the region. Uh, or maybe you haven't seen it, but we do have chances of that throughout today. Looking like we are going to be seeing these chances this morning uh, and then looking like that will exit by later. You can see that dark sky though around Santa Cruz, little breaks in the clouds as well. Uh, not quite seeing that sun yet. The sun comes up a little over 20 minutes from now uh, and we will have a mix of sun and clouds. So 60 degrees right now showing a clear sky. Mm, I don't think we quite have that clear sky. Uh, that's an automated icon that sometimes uh, under or over does it. Uh, but look at this. This is the rain that I'm talking about coming up from the south. Uh, you may have noticed those clouds yesterday, those mid-level clouds looking a little tropical. Uh, and that's going to continue today. And some of that actually bringing some rainfall. Now, some of this is suspended up in the atmosphere, meaning it's not quite falling to the ground. But the areas in yellow, that's looking likely that you're actually seeing some showers. Look at that around the Castroville to Moss Landing area. And, you know, I always appreciate your reports. Uh, Frank emailed me and let me know that they have some drops around the Castroville area about a half hour ago. Uh, so it's really nice to hear that, to know that it's actually raining because radars can't always pick up on that. So I appreciate the reports, Facebook, Twitter, email, uh, however you choose. It's greatly appreciated. 60s across the region. Uh, we are seeing some mild conditions, so warm to start. Also going to be a bit muggy today. Now you do notice though still dry in some of those hilltops. Uh, so that's one of the reasons that we may not see that rain falling to the ground because it's still drier at the surface. Uh, but overall the whole state seeing some more moisture. Look at all that green in the desert communities uh, received some rainfall there. The Oak Fire as well as the McKinney Fire sitting at higher relative humidity for now. And we typically see this time of year. So that is good news. Uh, however, still pretty toasty in those areas. Northern California, some low 90s. But last week, it was well into the hundreds. So seeing improving conditions with humidity as well as temperature around those fires. Uh, but also seeing lots of lightning. Look at all of that activity uh, in the, the southern part of California, the southeastern part and into uh, the four corners of the southwest of the U.S. So seeing those showers and for us, we could actually get some of that as well. A little muggy out there with lots of 60s. Even our coolest spots only in the upper 60s for today. Uh, so really looking like a nice day. Those shower chances, though, if you do have plans this afternoon, I don't think it's going to rain. This is mainly going to be before noon. So that's why we just have morning shower chances and then it clears out and pretty nice week ahead. Yeah, that rain, not significant enough to cancel any plans, really. No, I'd say not. But, you know, if your hair is sensitive, bring an umbrella this morning. You may want it as you head out to your car. You sort of wish it would be worse. Though, uh, yeah, you know? I know, right? We'd like it to drench for yeah. a little bit, but don't think that's really Help the case. Help us out with those drought conditions. Mm -hmm. All right, thanks, Gina.